Just last thing, I hate, this is we're having so much fun. At least we're having fun, the three of us are, but I don't know if anybody else is, but, but like, okay, thanks. So we got to, we got to Baltimore and, and, and we got, had a guy named Ed Reed, okay? Greatest safety in the history of the game. And Ed, Ed is a great player and a great guy. I mean, studied football, loved and everything, but he was up and down. He would tell you to this day, when, when the hood was up and the face was covered up, that was an Ed that you really weren't gonna talk to that day. Other times he'd come in, he'd smile, and he'd, he'd be your guy. But we had a lot of clashes early on because Ed didn't like the way we were doing things, didn't see it. And there were even times like, and he, he said it later, we're on the bus ride home from the Super Bowl, and he kind of looked at me, and he smiled, and he said, he said, now I see it. Now I see it, coach. Now I see it. Now I understand. And we both knew what he meant. And there were times that we didn't talk to each other for weeks. We would, I, I would make a point, I didn't talk to him because I didn't really appreciate the way he was treating me. And he wasn't being respectful of the program. And we'd walk by each other and not say hello. And I, but I knew it bothered him. And I knew it, but, but before that happened, I told him. I, I said something along the lines of, I, I know you, you may not like me and you may not be doing the, we may not be doing things the way you think they should be done, but that's not gonna change the way I feel about you, man. I love you. And then just walk on. Now, I don't need to say hi to him for three weeks if he's gonna be in a bad mood. But every player on your team should feel like you like them, and even more than that, that you love them. That you love them. If they're on your team, you're their dad, all right? They deserve your love. And if you can't like them or love them, then they really, either you shouldn't be the coach or they shouldn't be on your team, all right? Every player should know that you love them and you care about them, even when they act crazy, and even when you discipline them, even when you tell them it's not okay. Listen, it's not okay. You're gonna be over there on the end of the bench by yourself. But I still love you. I still love you.